to the spot in our relationship with the sun where we were when you started your journey. And uh, sometimes birthdays are awkward, especially if you have orbited the sun more than 40 times. Sometimes birthdays can be a little awkward. But a lot of the awkwardness, I think, is just because we have some uh, strange ideas about time, you know? Uh, we say that birthdays come and go, and we say that years come and go. Uh, years do not come and go. We orbit through them. <laughs> Birthdays do not come and go. We orbit through them. Uh, we are not victims of time. We are passengers on a planet. Uh, and it's an incredible journey that we're on. So you have a few more wrinkles. Big deal. It's an incredible journey. <laughs> and uh, the more you keep your eye on the sky, the more you see how the sky scenery is going by and you realize, wow, we really are on a journey. Huh? Uh, anyway, so um, also, obviously, it's Thanksgiving, and because I'm kind of weird, um, when I give thanks at Thanksgiving, I give thanks to something that happened about three and a half billion years ago. Anybody know what happened on this planet about three and a half billion years ago? Life started. Yeah, up until three and a half billion years ago, thank you. <laughs> up until three and a half billion years ago, uh, this was, uh, as best anyone can tell, a lifeless planet. And a substance um, that didn't have any name at the time, but now goes by the name of blue-green algae, somehow figured out how to transform the light of the sun into more of itself. <laughs> and uh, at that point, light became life. It's called photosynthesis. And there's a whole lot of creatures doing photosynthesis these days, but it all started with that first little thing that we now call blue-green algae. And uh, scientists know very, very little about photosynthesis. I mean, they barely crack the surface of it. Um, it's so complex. Um, and the transformation of light into life happens at such incredible speeds that scientists had a really hard time just creating devices to monitor the speed, devices that could work that fast. Um, so we really don't know what's happening. All we do know is that when we eat, we're eating sunlight um, that has been made available to us by these amazing creatures called plants. <laughs> um, so when I give thanks on Thanksgiving, um, I'm giving thanks for the food on my plate, but I'm also giving thanks for living on a planet where we can actually eat the light of the star that we're orbiting. Yeah. And I hope you enjoy that too. <laughs>